Boston Police Commissioner William Evans makes it official. As WBZ first reported nearly a month ago, he is retiring from the department. And to take his place, the city's first ever African-American police commissioner, William Gross, who will start his new job at the top next month. WBZ's Anaritis Rodriguez is live for us outside of BPD headquarters tonight. And Anaritis Gross kept this promotion a secret from his own family. Yeah, it's a really neat story. He actually told his mom that he was getting some sort of award, and she was surprised to see his promotion in person. You'll see that in the piece coming up. But Mayor Walsh says that Evans' is successor is the right fit because they both have similar backgrounds. They grew up in working-class families in the city and have dedicated decades to the department. I'm here today to let everyone know that I'm going to be resigning my post as Boston Police Commissioner. After nearly four decades in the force, Boston's police commissioner says he's out. Just started my 39th year. You know, it's been an Evans' departure, first reported by WBZ in June, was announced from City Hall earlier today. During his tenure, Evans became known for playing a key role in the city's response in the manhunt for the Marathon Bombers, his efforts to diversify the force, and his tough stance on guns. You know, the amount of guns, we've almost taken 3,800 guns off the street. Uh, you know, our use of force complaints are down 46%. The 59-year-old South Boston native rose through the ranks, first joining the force in 1982. You know, I was a patrolman for five years, a, a sergeant, a lieutenant, a captain for 12 years, a superintendent, and now commissioner. There's been a lot of challenges out there, but I think we're in a good place. Mayor Walsh says it's a good place to welcome a historic changing of the guard. We're losing an incredible leader today and bringing in a leader right behind him who will be an incredible leader. That leader is Chief William Gross, Evans' second in command, who will now become the city's first black police commissioner in the oldest police department in the country. Um, Similar to Evans, well, Gross grew up in Boston, start. started as a cadet, and has been with the force for three decades. But what I think we have here in the city of Boston is a vision. Where do we want to be? We don't want to emulate the past. Those are teachable moments for us, but we're going to continue to go forward. The appointment came as a surprise to Gross's mom. She was beaming with pride in the front row as the mayor made the announcement. Let's hope that other people can achieve this, you know. There are kids out there that don't think, oh, we can't do this. This is never going to happen. But it can happen, and he's showing that it can happen. Gross's first day on the job will be next month. Evans will take over the public safety department at Boston College, and he begins on August 6th. He says that he's looking forward to spending more time with family and getting more sleep. Reporting live tonight outside Boston Police Headquarters, I'm Anna Ritas Rodriguez, WBZ News.